The investigator is trying to beef up their tools for investigating big rig wrecks, Tammy. That's right, Megan. As 16 WAPT's Hadass Brown reports, this new technology could show who's accountable for those wrecks. Mississippi is tapping into a new tool to investigate what causes big rig truck crashes on the highway. As everything in our lives becomes more computerized, uh, there's little pieces of data that get stored in various components on board commercial vehicles. Now several trucking companies are installing black boxes, like the ones airlines use in planes. This week, MHP is learning how to use that information. When was the brake applied? When was the crutch, clutch applied? And in very limited number of vehicles, what kind of steering angle was uh, input by the driver. The information goes from the engine to these laptops and with that new training, investigators will be able to do all of their own analysis. One important factor, what the driver was doing right before the wreck. We give them a bill of lading, a semi-trailer full of cargo and a set of keys. The motor carrier doesn't really know how fast he's driving that truck. The black boxes will indicate if there was a clear threat on the road and the driver missed it. Then we start to look at things like maybe we ought to check out the cell phone usage. In 2014, there were nearly 1,400 big rig wrecks in Mississippi. Leaders hope that state investigators can save time and money by logging on to this new technology. It comes into play of what, whether you're spending taxpayer money to actually go to a trial or whether you, with the overwhelming evidence, you got someone just uh, gives a plea deal. In Pearl Hadass Brown, 16 WAPT News. A special grant helped to pay for that training.